Congressional leaders from around the nation meeting in Edinburgh, speaking about immigration reform today. Action Force Nestor Mata was there and joins us now to tell us what was discussed. Nestor. Members of the Congressional Hispanic Caucus uniting for a roundtable discussion. Several Valley organizations also there voicing their concerns about immigration. U.S. Representatives Ruben Hinojosa and Filimon Vela hosting an immigration reform roundtable at the Edinburgh Doctors Conference Center Saturday morning. One of the most important issues uh, of our time is immigration reform, so it was important to have a, a dialogue with uh, people from our community. Officials speaking out about the need for change when it comes to immigration, saying the House has failed to properly discuss it. Why? The House of Representatives could not take a vote on it when the U.S. Senate did do that on a bipartisan manner. 80% of the population of the United States say that is long overdue. 25 Valley organizations who help immigrants and undocumented people attending, saying families are being ripped apart, children treated like criminals in detention centers. We see a lot of mothers that do live in fear and need help. These are the issues that we must address in comprehensive immigration reform. Comprehensive immigration reform favors giving a citizenship path to the 12 million undocumented immigrants already here. At the same time, putting policies into effect to discourage future undocumented immigration. Policies include increased border security and employer sanctions for the hiring of undocumented immigrants. U.S. representatives from New Mexico and California also in attendance. They agree that as border states, they see immigration issues firsthand, saying immigration laws need to be amended. We have to redirect our approach uh, to the issue of immigration. Uh, it rhetoric like Donald Trump's rhetoric about border walls. Look at it from a human rights perspective. Congressman Vela says the fix has to be made in other countries to see real changes here. Until we address issues of security in Mexico and Central America, because if you're not safe and um, there's no economic hope, uh, you're always going to go somewhere where there is. Those in the audience hoping the meeting will lead to change. I hope everything gets straightened out and education for the all, for all children. Congressman Vela went on to say that the long-term immigration fix will come when the governments of the U.S., Mexico, and Central America come together to address it. In the studio, Nestor Mato, Action 4 News.